One of the biggest problems we're facing right now in terms of water pollution is that it's invisible. You go to the map in your newspaper for the weather and you've just got this instant understanding of the temperatures across the nation. Well, we want to have the same kind of instant understanding of the pollution in your own backyard. The concept of a canary in the coal mine was that back before coal miners had the kind of sensors they have nowadays, they used to take canaries down with them. They knew if the canary healed over, they needed to get out of there quickly. The canary is what's known as a broad spectrum bioassay, and the canaries were very sensitive to these poisonous gases. So the same thing is true with what we use to test the sediment. Bioluminescent bacteria. add different concentrations of your sediment sample to those bacteria and see how much it impacts how bright they are. They're being made sick by the toxins, but they have this visual manifestation of being sick, which is their light dims. And so this allows us to actually make it visible. Because we have such a density of things going on now, we developed this monitoring device that could tell us where the pollution was coming from. Kilroy allows us to pinpoint the source of the pollution, and so it measures a whole range of things, but two of the critical ones are flow, speed, and direction. And so that gives you the context of where the pollutants are coming from. Our only hope for our future on this planet is that we all become good stewards of our environment and people act like it has nothing to do with them. And they need to be protecting those life support systems as though their very lives depend on it, because they do.